All right, everybody, what is up? It's Vito. So I've been hearing a clicking sound coming out of that glove box, and I didn't know what it was. I figured out it was the actuator. So it's the door actuator, and I bought one of Amazon for 25 bucks, Canadian. I also recommend you guys to get one of these little keys, these little things, really important because it's so hard to get in there to unscrew the uh, other actuator so i'm going to show you what to do um what you got to do is you want to open this and then here there's two push little buttons on each side so you just push on those two and pull down the glove box and then it just hooks on that from there, it has like a little hook. All you gotta do is push it up and out. There you go, and the thing comes out. So the glove box is out, easy. Now we just have to go get in there. And there's gonna be two screws on that actuator. But first you have to unplug it. There's the plug right there. And there's a little button, the little hook that you just push in and down so yeah so push in and then just pull that out set it outside then you're gonna use your new little device to unscrew it and take it out all right so here you have it these are the two actu actuators so this will be the old one this will be the new one that I'm going to be installing. But we're going to open up this old one just to see what it's like inside. So also, when you are taking the screws out, make sure that you remove enough to make them loose and the rest do it with your hands because you might lose them inside the uh, cabin, okay? So be aware of that. So let's open it up and then see what's wrong with this one. So I think I found the problem. This gear is broken. So that little piece is supposed to be attached to that end over there, but it's broken. So I think that is what's causing the problem. So we're just going to install the new one and hopefully everything works out perfectly. All right, so I put it back on. I don't know if you can see it, it's right there. So now all we got to do is hook it up and test it. So let's plug it in. Well, it goes one way. All right, so let's start the car and see what happens. Still waiting. No more sound. Problem solved. 